coming up? Are you going to a party? Do you want to scare your friends? Are you planning a frightening photo shoot? We'll show you five totally awesome makeup ideas for any of these occasions. Come on! Do you want to be trendy on this Halloween? Try this incredible IT 2017 Pennywise the Dancing Clown Halloween Makeup. We'll use stage makeup to create the appearance of the Halloween characters, so we need to take care of the skin. Apply moisturizing cream base before you start. Then, cover your face with a thick coat of foundation to protect your skin from drying. OK, the base is ready. Let's get started with the design. Hide your hair under a swimming cap. As you remember, Pennywise had no bangs. Cover your face with white makeup, including your lips, lids, and brows. Make the coat thick and even without stains. Apply the white coat on top of the swimming cap. If you don't want to be an egg at the Halloween party, then continue. Apply black makeup on the area around your eyes. Blend the borders to get a smoky eye. Repeat on the second eye. Start your lip makeup. Apply bright red color. Define the outline. Are you scared already? It's not completed yet. Make a line across your cheek. Start in the middle of your lower lid. Make a curve near your nose wing and finish in the corner of your lips. Continue the line above the eye. Begin in the center of the upper lid, cross the brow curve, and stop at the beginning of the cap. Make the line wider on the upper lid. Repeat the mirror image on the other side. Add a clown nose. Paint red the tip and the nostrils. Put on a clown wig. Wow! The makeup's extremely frightening. You'll be the best horror movie star at the Halloween party. Just be careful to avoid scaring old women and kids. We don't think anyone would like to encounter such a spooky clown on a dark street. Are you still wondering why many people are scared of clowns? It's thanks to Stephen King. A black cat is a classic symbol of Halloween. Do you want to feel like a cat? Then do the next awesome makeup. Outline your upper lip using a thin brush and black color. Separate it into two halves with a vertical strip. Define an eye shape in the center of a half. Repeat the mirror image on the other half. Paint your upper lip black. Keep the eye-shaped areas uncolored. Cover the lower lip black. Apply bright green makeup on the unpainted areas. It'll be cat's eyes. You can shade them yellowish. Make vertical lines in the center of each eye to define cat's pupils. Add light ears on top. Outline them with black eyeliner. Add whiskers in the upper lip corners, three on each side. Be sure to make a tail. Draw a curved line from your cheek to your lip corner. Cool! Has it been inspired by the Cheshire Cat? Add a black hat to your black cat image. Everyone has cat ear headbands, but you'll be the only one with cat lips. Your friends will be impressed to see this amazing Halloween makeup design. Have you tried all the popular appearances of clowns, vampires, zombies, and Harley Quinn? Are you out of fresh ideas of what designs to choose this time? Create this totally awesome glam and gore Halloween makeup. Mark pattern borders on your face. Use a light outliner pencil. Start above your eyebrow, taking in your eye and cheek. It shapes like a stretched diamond. Cover your eye with a cotton pad. Attach it to your skin with eyelash adhesive. Attach another pad lower. Use a sponge to apply white glue to the pads and around your skin. Separate a napkin into layers. Tear off little pieces and glue them to the cotton pads in a papier-mâché way. 
Attach them and soak with white glue. Cover the skin around it. Wait until dry. Take tweezers and tear off tiny pieces of the dry glue. Leave the edges uneven. Create a torn skin wound effect. Apply the color that matches your face skin to the outer edge of the wound. Cover the wound with a bright red color. Add a blood red area. Apply a few dark red strokes to the center of the wound to make it look natural. Imitate bleeding across the edges. Add a dark bruise around the wound. Blend the makeup. We'll need red artificial roses of different sizes. Apply eyelash adhesive to each and attach it to the wound. Use tweezers to attach little flowers. Add a green leaf and a sprig and red frosted berries. Don't eat them, it's fake. Make the other smoky eye using regular makeup. Add a finishing touch. Apply fake blood. Use a brush to apply it on the wound edges. Add stains and streaks onto your lip and nose areas. Apply a lot of blood under the wound. To make your image complete, stick the red roses into your hair. The eerie rose witch has come to the Halloween party from the other world. It was her who turned the prince into the beast and gave him a rose in the famous fairy tale. The beautiful flowers don't seem cute on her head. Be careful and don't let her bewitch you. Ouch! I've pricked my finger with a toothpick. Wait, isn't it a perfect idea for Halloween makeup? Snip off toothpicks on one end. Color the sharp end with a black marker. Make a number of toothpicks for this amazing makeup. Melt a glue stick above the flame. Attach the cut toothpicks to hot glue drops on pink paper. When dry, take them off and attach double-sided tape. Attach them to your cheek. Disguise the hot glue and tape with red makeup. Imitate bloody wounds. Add dark red stains to make the skin around it look inflamed. Make the wounds more realistic by adding fake blood streaks. Oh God! The wounds look real. It hurts to look at them. We think face makeup is not enough. Let's use a hand. Repeat the makeup on your palm. Carefully apply red color of different shades to make the wounds and cuts look real. Add fake blood for a more terrifying appearance. I'm ready for a Halloween party. When my friends ask me what's happened, I'll tell them I fought with a porcupine or that I was a victim of a witch hunt. There's a rich choice of ideas, and it won't take you long to do this simple makeup. Do you want something classic like this creepy Halloween look? Let's do it together. Cover your face with white color. Leave your brows, lids, and lips unpainted. Define a line in the middle of your neck. Cover the area white up to the line. Apply black color on the area around your eyes. Don't spare the makeup. The black coat should be even and thick. Apply red color around the black. Make thin red lines from your eye down. Blend them. Draw thin blood vessels on top. Define your brow with a brown color. Repeat the same makeup design on the other side. Outline a crazy black grin. Draw upturned corners. Color the lips red. Imitate dark red blood streaks on your chin. Make black dots on your neck. Draw the upper row on the white part and the bottom one on the unpainted area. Apply a red borderline. Join the central dots with cross stitches and the side ones with vertical strips. Draw a heart in the middle with a black eyeliner. Shade it dark red. 
A cute spooky Frankenstein's daughter's makeup will be the creepiest at the Halloween party. How about going out? Can you go to your classes wearing this eerie makeup? Your classmates will remember your weird appearance until next Halloween. Are you ready to scare your friends with the spookiest makeup designs? Choose your favorite look, apply the makeup, post your pictures on Instagram, and put a Troom Troom hashtag. Write in your comments which makeup design you've chosen this year. Be sure to subscribe, hit the like button, and click the bell to get scared and have fun together.